284 years since signing of the treaty with the British and in all the 284 years the Maroons have prided themselves in the richness of our culture and our heritage and today stands nothing short of that and you know we are truly appreciative of all who came out amidst all the chaos to really come and show and pay homage you know to our ancestors and also to represent uh, the culture in its fullest. Um, we want to thank you know the the, the administrators, the, the the health officials, and you know the security team who has really worked hard today to maintain order, maintain protocols, and you know enabling us to have a safe event. So um, we want to continue wishing all Jamaicans, all Maroons, far and wide. You know all the best for the new year and look out for more and um it's nothing but positive vibes all right the, 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 in terms of the any difference from well previous years in terms of the attendance this year challenges that you have experienced this year well uh, as you know the the police high command had put out a notification regarding regarding the um the hosting of this event and because of their because of their, um, their uh, I gather, internal um, process, they would have advised uh, patrons not to attend. Um, as I would have highlighted earlier, this is quite surprising to me, considering in years gone by, this event was something that was staged, um, it was staged without, without hinder. And even amidst the COVID crisis, what we have put in place this year, in terms of protocols and using foresight, we would have had a more safer event than in, in prior years gone. So the fact that we were in discussions and dialogue, particularly with the Minister of Culture, Gender and Sport, so it's, it, it, it really uh, it, 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 it bothered me a little bit, I must be honest, you know. But nevertheless, um, we had a successful day and I think we're now pulling down the curtains on a 284 anniversary that I think our ancestors would have been proud of. I remember, is this the first time here at Akompong? I'm on only five years now. Alright, so talk to me about things going. Well, you know, it's slower than here still. But through the end, I say, you know, keep on watch the and then say police, then they are turn back to people. Very far, that's true. I just not even have for one of your people to come in. They say, now my last year, them kind of. No, we never come last year, for last year, we did say. Oh, the COVID, yeah. Yeah, man. The year before, all the time, my people last year, mother, you can't find it. Yeah. So, what you, you, you normally sell when you come out? What are you selling today? Right here, sir. What you selling? Jerk chicken, jerk pork, and festival. And what's your name? Uh, I'm Vanessa. And where are you from? Um, new building, St. Elizabeth. Alright, talk to me about your experience. First time here at um, Maroon Celebration? Yes, actually it is. And I was so excited. But when I came here, it's not what I expected, honestly. But we have to give thanks. Well, as according to home here, the celebration it was and how the gathering was and the activities that I don't see any of that going on here much. Oh. So, so it's kind of slow. It is. It is. Oh. It is a major, major. But you think it's probably what the police had said? You know, the police had put out a statement. Well, it is because as far as home heard, normally when you reach certain time in the morning. 
activities will be going on and 10 o'clock this morning, 11 o'clock this morning, nothing, you know, it seemed like say something was happening as opposed to about midday, everything actually started going so, well, as far as I'm seeing that, I don't have it. That is what happens. So you can tell me what's your name and where you're from? Oh, my name is Shipile and I'm from Germany. Oh, from Germany? Yes. Okay, so is this your first time at the celebration? No, this yes. is uh, in, in here. This yes. is the second time here. Okay, and how are you enjoying yourself so far? Very good. I like it again. Anything special you want to say to the Jamaican people? Uh, I love the country, I love the people, and um, I love to come back here again because I like it so much. This is my grandson. <laughs> Say hello.